This is episode two of the vlog. That's what I'm supposed to say. All right, see ya. That'll work. My name is Max Huggins, video producer for Clemson Football. As Andy noted in episode one last week, these vlogs will give you a raw, first-hand look at where we eat, where we play, where we grind, and where we shine. You see the touchdowns and hits on Saturdays. We want to show you the people behind the scenes who help make our football players be the best on and off the field. Each week we'll focus on a key area of the Clemson football program. This week, equipment. When I pull up, they notice me. Come and talk to me like Jodice. But don't you be too close to me. Them goons you see, let it go for me. I bring them things, I bring them things. I call the plug, he bring them things. Mucho. This is our rollaway system right here. This is pretty much all of our game helmets right here, 350 helmets or so. I have a master's in athletic leadership, and I learned that you know developing relationships with guys is you know it's it's what it's all about. You know, so I love doing that on a daily basis, just being able to interact with them and get closer to them and kind of learn more about them. That's what I enjoy the most. Huh? My suit. It's coming. I haven't talked to any here yet. Everybody else got a suit but me. When have I not? When have I done you wrong, man? I get you swag. I get you swagged out. All right, man. All right. I believe in you. All right. So right now I'm grabbing my stuff out of Cubby. You gotta put in your little code. Everybody got their own little code. The equipment room. Make sure we all got the towels. Make sure we all right. You ain't gotta worry about washing your own stuff. Everything nice, organized on the loop. So basically, I'm in the Weston zone, setting everything up for the coaches uh, on game day. So all I have to worry about is coming over. Getting dressed for the game and coaching. And Nick and those guys take care of all the player stuff and I take care of all the coaches. Game week. About to get this media in. Let's go. Yeah, I feel like we put the work in this summer, including this training camp, but in the spring as well. And it's been a, it's great to see the progress that we've made, you know. The fans, they love telling you just how great last year was. And we, we all trying to focus on this shit. But I feel like it's, it's good because it started from the inside out and we really passed that. And we just focus on this year's task. Good vibes in the air right now. Everybody's, you know, ready to get it going. But we still have a full week of preparation to go. So not just gonna look ahead, take one day at a time, just re get ready for this week. You know what the vlog is? Yes, which, oh, oh yeah, we do, this is um, episode two? Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 I know, yeah, I know what we're doing. All right. Just finished up interviews over here, you know what I'm saying? First, first a uh, game week, uh, media day, we got my boy Kelly over here. Hey, hey you already know Big Cleat, you yeah, know Kelly this, B, you know yeah. how we doing this thing. Like, this guy know interviews, y'all yeah. already know. Saturday, I'll be on look. We'll see y'all out there. You know it. Looks like the guys are ready for game day. But what about Death Valley? My name is Rick Tomlinson. I work with university facilities here at Clemson. I'm in my 29th year. My position is paint shop supervisor. And we paint all the athletic fields for athletics, baseball, soccer, football, practice fields, everything. And it's different than going in there painting the interior and exterior buildings day in and day out. And it's a challenge. Mainly I'm just concentrating on the line. We pull a strain to get a straight line and you can't think about a whole lot of different things or you might wind up back where you start, you know. After a while you get a feel for when the machine is tracking right and all. And when we paint the whole field, we use close to 140 gallon of the orange and on the white, around 75 gallons. Thanks to Rick and the crew, the field's looking great. Make sure to come out tomorrow for the opener and cheer on the Tigers. Shout out to Tiger Nation. I know y'all gonna be in Death Valley making 
making a great environment for us to play in. Go Tigers. It's your boy Kelly V checking in and checking out.